Hey there. <laughs> you don't have to look so startled. It's pretty clear why you're here. You're here for me. <laughs> Liar. I've seen you following little old me for like, oh gosh, what has it been now? One, two, three weeks? You think I don't notice, but I do. I see everything. <laughs> and people call me crazy. You gotta be pretty crazy to be following me. Especially with the old boss watching. I'm surprised he hasn't even asked about you yet. <laughs> so, I'll continue this little game you have going on for a little longer. You gotta be answering some questions of mine first. So what do you want? You looking to get info on the good old boss, eh? You some topsider in disguise. Or to top it all off. You're here for me. What? Cat got your tongue? <laughs> and you know, you're kind of fun to talk to. It's been a while since I've actually talked to somebody. <sighs> Silco's always so busy with his things, and Savika takes the fun out of everything. She's always like, Jinx, don't go in my room. Jinx, stop painting my things. Jinx, stop unlocking my door and going into my bra drawer, because you can't fill any of them anyways. And I mean, I wasn't even going into her room to get bras for that reason. <laughs> Who needs those anyways? They're just so interesting to look at. They're so plush and big and like, I needed the straps. It's hard to come by materials down here and I was getting tired of asking Silco for things. I wanted to find them myself. What were we talking about again? Right, you. Ah. <sighs> That if I ask you my next question, our little game will be over and I'll be back to sitting in the rafters, tinkering with things. So, why are you here? What do you want with me? Oh my. What? What do you, what do you mean? No, oh, you, you, you want to be my friend. I, I, I don't even know you. You don't know me. Really? Oh, I mean, well, it would be kind of nice to have someone else to talk to with other than... No. No, they aren't lying. Shut up. What? Oh, it, it, it's, it's nothing. I... Why would you want to be my friend? I'm in with one of the most powerful men of Zahn. Being my friend. That's not easy. <laughs> and why should I believe you? You can be telling me this lie, so you that way you can be my friend, and you can get close to Silco, and you can just do whatever it is everybody else does. <sighs> well, yeah, I guess there is no danger in just hanging out with you in here in the last drop anyways. As long as you don't ask too many questions. But why would you want to be my friend anyways? As I said, you don't know me, I don't know you. And I'm pretty sure you've heard enough stories about me around in other city to write a whole book. 
not a good one. Or maybe a good one. A book about me does sound pretty nice, but... So, <laughs> why? What planet are you living on? I seem like a nice person. I seem cool, interesting. Well, I mean, the interesting part and cool part may suffice, but... That's usually not what people think about me. Not usually their first thought. Usually it's crazy. <laughs> Very crazy. Oh. So you like crazy. Oh, well. <laughs> I can probably fill that role for you then. In more ways than one. All right, then. I guess we can continue this little game of ours. You following me all week, but instead maybe come and say hi. As I said, it gets boring sometimes around here. I can only tinker in my lab for so long before I just want to pull my hair out. Silk is always busy, busy, busy with his papers, and I can sit on his desk is all I want. He'll just eventually start putting the papers on my lap and writing away. Well, it, 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 I'm not lonely. I'm never alone. But it would, it'd be nice to hang out with you. But let me make myself pretty clear. You betray me or try to do anything. To Silco. <laughs> I'm pretty sure you've followed me long enough to know what happens. <laughs> but I'll give you the benefit of the doubt. For now. But if we're going to continue this little game of ours, I think it's about time I knew your name. <laughs> I just hope it's not something boring like Chuck. Chuck, Chuck, Chuck. Oh, that guy over there. <laughs> oh, he's quite a character. So, your name? Hmm. I like it. You don't really get many of those down here. Zahn tends to have names that aren't, well, like that. <laughs> you got Jinx, Silco, Chuck. Well, Chuck is the oddball. Chuck, 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 Chuck. So, I guess this makes us friends now. <laughs> Nothing. I just have a friend now. You don't really get to make many friends down here that are... don't have ill intentions. Everything has a price, no matter what it is. So, new friend? I guess we can hang out here for a bit. Just me, you, me and you. <laughs> what do you say, uh, we meet up every day here, huh? Around this time, I, oh, it's usually my block where I just walk around and do nothing. But instead, I can spend it with you. <laughs> you really want to be my friend, right? Well, as I said, it's not many people want to be around me. So I'm just surprised is all. <laughs> well, uh... How about I get us a round of drinks, huh? On me. I don't have to pay when I'm here. 
<laughs> hey, Chuck. We'll have two of those over here. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? No, his name's Chuck. It's not Theorem. Never heard of a Theorem. <laughs> But I do have one more question for you. <laughs> what took you so long? Well, I mean, you've just been following me around. Not really doing much other than that. If I didn't notice you, which obviously it wasn't that hard to notice you, but if I didn't, you'd just be following me around. Not saying a word. Oh, you were nervous. I mean, I, 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 I guess that makes sense. <laughs> oh, oh, well, <laughs> yeah. So sorry about that. I know it's, uh, yeah, it's, yeah. But, uh, Thanks for saying all that stuff. No one ever really talked about me like that before. Or, or at least not for a long time. I like you. <laughs> I'm gonna keep you around for a long time. <laughs> if I have anything to say about it. So, let's make a toast, eh? Whatever the heck Chuck brought us, that is. <laughs> Let's make a toast to a new friendship that'll last for a long time. <laughs> or forever. Whichever comes first. Whichever comes first.